Let's see here. I want to do this little tune that uh, Steve and Andy and Tom and I have been on first Friday and on uh, over there in Phoenix. Have been hanging around this place called Gloria's. It's a jewelry store up there on Grand Avenue. And one night I wandered into the uh, Paisley Violin, and I decided, yeah, I want to do a song about the Paisley Violin. And so it kind of it kind of came out in this song. And uh, I uh, basically, I think, it, I think eventually uh, it'll be a song. I haven't really decided uh, if it's going to become the Paisley Violin song or the Grand Avenue song, but. Uh, Late again, here I am on Grand Avenue at the Paisley Violin, and I'm looking for a girl who looks like you. Well, I think I saw you yesterday. You had a flower in your hand. You were playing a ukulele and wearing purple tennis shoes. Well, you were singing love songs with this band called Uncle Nets. Down on Grand Avenue with the Paisley Violin, it's late again. Here I am on Grand Avenue at the Paisley Violin, and I'm looking for a girl that looks like you. Now, before we go any further, Andy actually like wrote most of the imagery on the last verse for this, the one about the food when we get back to the Paisley violin. But the last time, uh, last time we were down here doing the songwriting thing, uh, it was the hardest thing I've ever done. Well, I started writing the song about an old cowboy that buried his wife, and then I had this heart attack, and I never made it down here. And... So anyway, so I thought it was important that I put a verse about a cowboy in this song. Uh, I saw this guy, he was standing up at a Walgreens store, and I... There's a Baptist church down there just off Grand Avenue, and I thought it was worthy of the song. And I learned this thing about talking and singing from Utah Phillips. So you, can stop, uh, you can actually stop singing and start talking, and then if you can get back inside the song, you don't have to do a rampant Jack Elliott kind of thing. You can just do a Valley of the Sun kind of thing. Well, I know an old-time cowboy lives on 8th Avenue, right across from the Baptist church that was grand when it was new. Now he rides a wheelchair instead of a pinto horse and tries to rope the neighbor's cat when it runs across his porch. Your porch is late again. Here we are on Grand Avenue at the Paisley Violin and I'm looking for a girl who looks like you. This uh, one verse, we were down there at this glorious place uh, one Friday and they were having some poets across the street that had the sound system turned up about as loud as the band that played earlier and they were doing like a revival, a Hispanic revival meeting down the street and so I wanted to do a little verse about that. So this is a little verse that uh, came out of that if I can catch it. I might have to get back into it. Sometimes I can't remember all these verses on these uh, newer old songs, but I may have to do another verse song. No, here it is. This is how it goes. There's a homemade bodega and a ponderia too. Where Juan and Maria, they can get a bite or two. Crave across the border just before daylight. They're looking for their savior on Grand Avenue tonight. It's late again. And here I am on Grand Avenue. We at the Paisley Violin, and I'm looking for a girl that looks like you. Well, an old pretty artist, she's got a gallery of her own. But only likes one color, and that is red, you see. Well, all of her paintings, well, they look the same to me. But down on Grand Avenue, well, I think what it seems. It's late again. Here I am on Grand Avenue. Wet pays that violin, and I'm looking for a girl who looks like you. Now I'll try this verse that Andy did all the imagery on. It's a tongue twister kind of a thing because Grand Avenue and the Paisley Violin get inverted in a backwards kind of a direction. And if I get kind of messed up, I'll have to get into the school of overs to uh, see if I can get into this verse. This is your life going on down here, you know, with the uh, Cheeto Bandito place down here. So uh, that's not really the correct name of the restaurant. <laughs> it's pretty good though. It works out pretty good. Here we go. Well, uh, da, 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 da. What kind of 
chicken is that? Shawarma. Shawarma chicken. I usually just eat like tacos and stuff like this. Some fancy names and lots of stuff. But I'm not too good on it. <laughs> They'll feed you shawarma chicken or pork green chili stew. Food that's good for your soul and for your body too. Might even fall in love before the night is through. At the Paisley Violin on Grand Avenue. It's late again. Here I am on Grand Avenue. We have to pay to play the violin, and I'm looking for a girl that looks like you. Now I'll do the first verse last because down in Texas they have a tradition where on cowboy songs, and since we put a cowboy song verse into this song, we can do this. They always sing the first verse and the last verse first. Well, I think I saw you yesterday at a flower in your eye. You were playing a ukulele and wearing purple tennis shoes. Well, you were singing love songs with this band called Uncle Ned. Down on Brand Avenue with the Paisley Violin. Thank you. John Austin.